YouTube, it's Lewis Fitcher again and as my, in my previous video, if you haven't seen it, I'll put a link to my previous video of how to jailbreak an iPod, I'm sure many of you know how to now seeing as there's so many videos on YouTube but I thought I might as well put one on there because you know, I want to keep my viewers happy um, so here we go so this video is going to be about Cydia, Installer and Winterboard Tutorial now, I know when I jailbroke my iPod, I had these three things and I had no idea what to do with it. It took me a while to find out actually what they meant. They don't really give you an explanation of what it is or what it actually does in general. So you are a bit stuck at first. So I'm just going to show you that today. So, here we go. So, let me just rest this up here. I think it'll be a lot, lot easier. Hang on. Excuse me a sec. I think that would be a lot, lot easier. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to just. Oh, thanks for turning off again. What we're going to do is just going to do that. Okay, come to this. Now, obviously, around this area, you will have it because it will be totally restored. So, City is just down here. Okay, so it looks like this brown, horrible box thing icon. So, you click that. Yeah, well. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, I know. Yes, I know. Thank you. Return to city. Okay, let's get out of there. I was downloading something. Right. Oh, God. Didn't want to go right out of it. Okay, so it does take a, quite a while when you first download it, uh, when you first jailbreak, because it needs to do everything and it asks for a restart or restart springboard. You know what a springboard is, it means just re like resetting all the settings of the actual iPod. Uh, so you come to this page, welcome to Cydia. Downloading packages, it will top it will say, reloading data, yada yada yada. Okay, so after that's done, after that's done that is. You'll be like this, stuck with all this stuff at the bottom, like what is all this? What is all that? And you've got this search. So first, let's start on the home page first, I think will be easier. Um, I think I'll just do a video just on Cydia to be honest, because there's a lot on this. So first things I got, I looked at as I was looking through, was click featured packages. Okay, so it comes down to all this sort of stuff, Snapchat, all this extra little things you can do. Now, MX Tube, right there. If I can just zoom in, right there. There's MX Tube. Save YouTube. Okay. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to click that. Okay. So at the top will be, as you can see here in a sec, at the top will be install. But obviously, I've already installed it. So I click modify, and it'll be somewhere there, click install. You'll come up with a whole page of weird messed up writing going crazy on you. Don't worry. And at the bottom it'll click it'll say return to Cydia. Just click that. And then just click the home button. Alright? You'll come out. And then it'll be this little thing here. This MX tube. Now a good thing with this is that obviously I'll come up with that. Is that it's from YouTube. So use YouTube, type whatever you want in. Like I don't know. Let's just put hello in, It'd be a lot easier, instead of actually thinking of something. So put hello in for for example. You need the internet obviously. So Lionel Richie, hello. Loads of views. Yay. So you click that, it'll come up with this stream, download, whatever. Uh, you click download really is the best one to do. So you click that and then you've got your choice, high is best. Okay, so you go down to that bit and it's doing it for you. I'm just going to exit out of that because I don't like mine already. Go away. Cancelled. Good. Clean up. Gets rid of all of it. Done. So you go to videos and then you can view it whenever you want with or without connection. Yep. And you can get pretty good high definition stuff. Anyway, back to Cydia. More stuff that... Well, that was good. Real smooth, Lewis. Real smooth. Anyway. Here we go. 
Okay, so there's sections at the bottom here. Now, obviously, you scroll down there's endless amounts of folders and all sorts. So, the best thing you're going to really be looking at on Cydia is actually themes. So, you can see them here. Then you've got battery themes. Quite self explanatory. It changes the battery when you're actually charging your iPhone. So, you click that. You come to loads of times. So you've got beer, caffeine, cannabis battery, car battery. Click on one. Alright. You click install. Okay. You click confirm. It's running. Running. Confirming. Reloading. Let's have a look at that there. Reloading data. See those weird numbers again? All the sorts. This is return to Cydia button. Click it. Okay, come to this bit here again. And you can scroll down and there will be sometimes a picture. Usually on Planet iPhones there is a picture. Take screenshots. You click that. If we can click it, there we go. And you'll come down, there's a nice little picture here. There, of the car battery. Okay, so you're like, yeah, 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 I've got this. How do I apply it? It doesn't work. All sorts. So what you're going to do is you're going to have to go back. Now we're going to be using a thing called Winterboard. Now Winterboard doesn't actually download anything as such, but it actually does do something pretty cool. Um, okay, so you'll come and you'll probably see loads of stuff that you've downloaded. And obviously, these tick stuff and everything. You can tick it. So you come to there's car battery at the top which you just downloaded. So you want to click that, okay? And you want to go out there. And then it all spaz out like that. It all go crazy, don't worry, it's just respringing. And then when it's done, it should hopefully work. Um, I don't think I can show you, because I don't have anything. But I will show you another one. I will go to Winterboard. Okay. Go on. Uh, let's go on. Yeah, let's just. I don't like doing that actually. Sorry about this. Punished video. So we click that. That's one of them you can get. Okay, just get out of there. Spaz out again as it always does. As it respring's. Sometimes it doesn't. Don't worry. It doesn't really matter what it does at that point. So it spaz out, give it time. And there you go in the background, you can see there's a video going on. That isn't a very good animated video because it does stop sometimes. I will be showing you all these extra things you can get for it. But anyway, back to what Cydia can do. Um, nearly wrapping this up actually on Cydia. I did show you a bit what Winterboard can do. So maybe this is Cydia and Winterboard video all in one. Um, so Winterboard just helps with Cydia when you download certain things it applies it and you can unapply it and all sorts like that um, also with Cydia you can add sources now sources are where you get your download stuff from it's usually just URLs which are addresses so you go into like, for, for the internet you go in packages, sources and storage um, the only reason you're going to want these if you're going to download something different which obviously you haven't uh, got which they provide so just go edit and then you go add pops up with a source what you can do okay I think that's pretty much it I'm running out of time but one more thing about winterboard is hang on scroll down there's this you come down to this dim wallpaper dim icons black navigation bars you got the best one I think is um, no undocked icon labels or no docked icon labels. That's pretty much the labels which are on here on the icons. You see, the dock is at the bottom, I've labelled that, and the undocked is everything over here which I haven't. Okay, so my next video will probably be uh, I've just done a bit on Cydia, or a lot on Cydia, and a bit on um, Winterboard. I will be doing some on Installer as well in my next video. So I'll see you later.